about gorgeous unique youtubers welcome back to my channel thank you guys for clicking on this video first off let me just say that so obviously before we get started with this video you guys see it, it is a haul from Amazon and a little bit from Walmart also a little bit of test so to see um, basically the stuff that I got so we're gonna do that but first off, let me just say you guys see that obviously you see more light here you see my background y'all know if y'all watched a couple of videos some months back when I was still pregnant y'all know I have my own little lighting system and the backdrop and stuff like that too you know like the other little youtubers I just don't I spit I just don't use it as much because it's in my upstairs I'm upstairs right now and I don't a lot of times I don't feel like going upstairs and I have my kids right now my son is asleep so this is the perfect timing for me to actually do a video because other than that he would be just trying to get on my nerves so I usually do a video whenever I could so you guys can see it now it's all nice I ain't it. so I'm gonna try guys to keep doing videos with like this lighting and just making it so you guys can see how I actually look yeah, more clear, I guess, and give you guys a better video. So all that extra talking, whatever, I'm sorry. So let's get started, guys. So I ordered from Amazon uh, quite, a, uh, quite a bit of stuff. I mean, it's not huge things, but it's quite a bit of stuff. So I'm going to start from the smallest package to the biggest package that I got. Um, and then I'm going to just show you guys as I pull out. So let's start opening up. I got my little scissors. Okay, I gotta open. So guys, majority of this stuff is stuff for my beauty room. You guys know that, <coughs> for those who actually have been following me for a long time, you know that I have my own little beauty room, I call it, uh, where it's all my nail stuff, my makeup, whatever I want in here is basically what I want. It's not fixed up at all. I'm in here now. I can show you guys a good glimpse if this video is not long. If it's too long, I'm probably gonna just, if I show you guys, but I'm probably gonna clip it out and then put it as a different video or something. But it's my beauty room for my nails. Y'all know I do acrylic nails. I do the, you know, all the fake nail stuff too and the waxing and all them good bits. So that's basically what I ordered. So I just want to show you guys the unboxing. Let's see. Let's see what's the first thing in here. And I ordered some, like a couple other random stuff too. What's this? Oh, this is uh, stamping. These are the little stampers. Uh, so I guys know that I have the stamping. Basically what the stampers are for those who do nails is like the little uh, play things that have different types of like drawings that's basically carved into the metal and you put like polish on it and you scrape it off and then you put like the little stamper on it and then you put the stamper on your nails basically. So it's a stamper. You know, how you stamps basically. It's just for nails. But I bought stamping polish because I have a lot of nail polish. Not a ton but a lot. But I want polish that's going to really show up and it's going to be nice and I ain't got to be trying to test which one of my own polishes actually work for my uh, nails for the, doing it. So since I'm trying to take nails seriously within a couple years or more, you know, I go to school and stuff, I want to be able to have my own nail salon and stuff, you know, be a boss, yeah. So I'm just giving it timing though. All good things go in good timing. I ain't finna rush it. Take my time and when I get there, I'm gonna get there. So I'm opening up you guys to show you guys basically what they are. So this is a nice, see it's a nice gold. Gold. Hope you guys can see it. I know sometimes when the good thing about having the light is that it is light, but sometimes it's too bright, you know? And it kind of messes up the colors. Of some things so I got so I got uh, a gold I got a um, let me see I got a nice blue look at this blue that's a really nice blue ain't it so I'm not gonna go through each and every one of them guys and show you in this video because that's gonna make the video longer than it needs to be but that's one two three four five six so I ordered six of them so that's what this package was. Like I said, I'm not going to go through each one because I don't want to make this video long. So if you guys want to see them and see my actual stamping collection, whatever I'm trying to build up, I can do that in like another video. Alright, so let's open up this package. This actually was the smallest package, but I didn't even notice it. Alright, so in this one is I ordered some more acrylic powder. So 
So I already have acrylic powder, but I wanted to try out Maya Secret. Uh, I was looking up on, you know, like Amazon and stuff. What's a good acrylic to use? It's not super duper expensive, but it's, you know, <coughs> a good quality though. And it's not cheap. I, I used to go to Sally's all the time and get my acrylic. That acrylic from Sally's is fine for, you know, of course, like me, a beginner. But it's not the greatest. And even though I'm a beginner, I want to use good quality stuff. So when I do my nails, I know that it's good quality. And it's not the quality. It's my technique you get it that's not good not the quality of it so basically I ordered the Maya secret this is a four ounce this is a natural pink acrylic powder Look that what is this what is this Okay, so this is what this is, guys. This is the nail training hand. Alright, guys. So this box is open, and what I have in here are fowlers, nail fowlers. They're all colors. Look at it. Rainbow. Ooh. So I have a nail fowlers because I need some more of these. I want to... Get some different ones. These are, I don't know what grid they are. But, yeah. Some nail fowlers. This huge roll. I didn't even know it was going to be this big. But look how big this is. See my head? And then you see this huge roll. These are the, um, what you call these? Nail forms. So these are nail forms. It's, ooh, a UV light. I got a, I have a Sun UV LED uh, lamp. This is a two in one. So yeah, it's a LED and UV lamp. And speaking of gel, I also bought this. This is a no wipe top. This is a UV LED soak off uh, <coughs> gel, gel base coat and a gel top coat. I know I didn't say where everything was from because everything is from Amazon. And I didn't say the brand of a lot. But I mean, you guys want to know, put it in the comments and I'll look at it before I throw this stuff away because I throw stuff away. And the next thing I got is these. These are applicators. So these are like um, eyeshadow applicators. And the reason I picked this is because you know how people put the metallic on their nails and stuff? They use these and stuff like that, other things to help like rub it in. Even though I didn't buy the metallic thing, I forgot to get the powder for that to make the metallic nails. I'm like, it's fine, it's whatever. I can still use this whenever I purchase it. I will still have it. And then I can also use it for whatever else if I need it <laughs> for anything else. Alright, next thing I got is some gel nail polish. So this is a gel nail polish. This is dusty. <laughs> so I have the color. I have like a, I have like a nice brown looking color, a pink, a nice uh, new pink, a lighter pink. I think um, red and a very light pink. I think. So there. I want to show you guys it because, like I said, if you guys really want to see, I'll just make another video. Next thing, guys is I have the well, same thing that goes to my um my mannequin head but I also ordered this mm. all right it's a mannequin head but it has hair on it so I could practice so this is the hair so I could practice braiding I could practice all that mainly mainly I'm gonna be using this head for braiding I have my biggest box right here guys but before I open that I'm gonna open I'm gonna show you guys what I got from Walmart because that box is too big right now for me to put it just right here and take up space so all right this is a little mini <clears throat> a little mini makeup 
So I got the cheap LA Colors makeup I um eyeshadow palettes. Like this, these little cheap ones. Because I don't have no eyeshadow palette. Y'all know I do my little makeup, but I I don't buy expensive makeup at all because I'm not a makeup artist. Nor do I wear makeup on a daily. Honestly, I don't really like wear makeup like that. That's why you guys hardly ever see me wearing makeup. I may do makeup once in a blue moon, so. But I do have it for when I want it. And I don't have any eyeshadow palettes. So when I want to kind of do a little something on my eyes so to make it don't look as, like, dead and dry, you know? So, I just got these little two little cheap ones. Then, I got me some more mascara. I got about, like, four different mascaras. But I like, I like... Maybelline's mascara. Um, I like some other ones too, but Maybelline has good mascara. Oh, I bought not two, I bought three. So, never mind, I got three. So, this one is obviously you guys can tell it has it's more neutral, <laughs> it has like the beige and like the nice tone brown, whatever those call, and then black. Look at me, I don't know nothing about makeup. And then this one has like a blue, and then the rest of them are like uh, peachy pinks, a little bit of purples, and like a white. It keeps spinning. And then this one is all basically mostly purples, a little, little bit of blue with some grays. So, this little makeup, my little makeup palette basically, you know. And then the last thing I got is some makeup, y'all. So, I got some Black Radiance. Years ago, I got Black Radiance. <coughs> I got their face primer. I got their face all finishing powder. Uh, I even, I think I got something else from them. I can't remember. Oh, uh, did I really care for Black Radiance like that? It was all right. Honestly, it was all right. It wasn't like, oh, okay, the greatest. I could really work good, good. I did like their, oops. <laughs> I did like their finishing powder, though. Their finishing powder actually was a pretty decent one. It actually went with my skin tone. But the primer didn't work. Y'all know I use that Milk Magnesia, which I'm not supposed to really use that. But until I get some money to get like a good primer that's actually going to really prime my face, I like a matte face. I don't like dewy glow because I'm already oily in my face. I don't want it. So I just want a nice matte face and I can't find a primer that helps matte me, you know? Um, but I got this. You guys see him? Foundation! I never buy foundation, guys. This is a this is an all free, all free foundation. I have it in the color espresso and brownie. So the reason why I got espresso and brownie is because I don't know my color for my face. I honestly really don't. You gotta tell me. My husband was there with me, he helped me. He told me that this is my face color. So we gotta do some swatches to actually see if it actually matches my damn face or not. You know, he he doesn't do makeup, you know? But he said that it's more of my color. So I guess we're gonna see. If anybody knows, I am like hyperpigmented and my face is darker than, you guys can tell, my hands. It's darker than the rest of my body. So my face and my neck is darker than the rest of my body. And I also got this one. So I have like three different shades almost. There's a really dark one, there's a a uh, sim darker, not really darker. It's a darker one, and this is a, a little bit darker, and then this is more lighter. <laughs> Alright, guys, so the last thing that I have is my biggest thing, which I already know what it is. It's the whole, you know, we go to the nail shop. You go to the nail shop, and you got, they sit at the table, you got the little cushion right there. And that's exactly what I got. Oh, it's like I gotta do some. I gotta do some screwing and stuff. So basically guys, this is the table. This is the table. Ooh. You guys see it? I hope you guys can see it. <laughs> um, I have to assemble it. So, uh, only thing I can say guys is once I assemble it, I'll show you guys it and maybe I'll assemble it and put my stuff on it too. And then see how long this video will be because I don't want it to be long. So, We'll see if it's too long. I may put this in a separate video. Just letting you guys know on, on a heads up. But subscribe to my channel, guys, if you want to see more videos from me. Also, if you want to follow me on any of my social sites, everything is in the description below, including my beautiful daughter's YouTube page, which she will be posting up a video actually. Um, maybe if not today, tomorrow. One of these days. She'll be posting up a video of her hair actually. I just washed her hair blow dried it and cut her in so you guys can actually see her little length a little bit you can't really see it to the extent because her hair does go all the way down to her butt but when it's just blow dried it just goes down you know to like 
That's our like top, you know, the not mid back, a little lower than her mid back. We can't really see it too much. So go watch her video, guys. And yeah, thank you guys for watching. Don't say but again. Bye. Done it quite. I can say but.